Bunge goes up, they do a class 6 final is underway and it is uh, the star 2 to 8 of Evan Smith uh, they teased up on first to tease up Howard RK96 is uh, there as well up on the inside is Chris Hamilton in that one not too oh dear Evan where are you going? right, uh, he's just jumped to the third man's first place Chris Hamilton he's Sweden then we've got Jamie Hornby then it's Gunthorpe 400 David Hughes a bit of next and I think it is at the Nottingham 6 of Kev Spriggs that lies in for 30 minutes then we've got Simon Smith in the start due to wait and then it's Sinkis in North Yorkshire 35 of John Johnson but uh, Kev Spriggs is heading up not quite right that's the North on the end of Spriggs Hamilton is losing out as well in the diesel power with IK 69 which means that you have a new leader in the form of Scunthor 400 it's Alan Hughes Starting to stretch his legs down that far side now. Jamie Holby, no answer as yet. In the 1047, but we've got a battle on the third. As uh, Chris Hamilton does come through, beard contact, I think. As Evan Smith goes sideways into the top corner. But uh, carrying on nonetheless, Evan still lies in third. Chris lies in fourth. And then we've got the North Yorkshire 35 with John Dustin and Kev Spriggs at the back of the pack with all the work to do at the minute in Nottingham number six. But down that far side, Alan Hughes in complete control at the minute. Here in the Scunthorpe 400, but let's not stick, let's not, let's not discount to anybody. Yes, yeah, we've still got a fair few more laps left to go yet, and this track in the conditions as it is, it could well make a difference to Alan Hughes. Just as I say that, looks like he's either got problems on board of a very, very slow corner, and Jamie Holman looks to take advantage up on the inside of goes. Is Chris Allison going to try it as well? He's not because he's got the door shut, but he's going to try and find it back over from the inside. He's trying to get not able this time to end the compass. It's Jamie Holman. He's now leader of Alan Hughes. He's there in Southern Forge. He's turning left to the corner. Not going to do all that much good. As he puts himself back down into fourth place, Chris Allison takes off second place then. Alan Smith back into the trophies in the start, 2 2 8. And uh, we've uh, lost, oh no, we haven't lost us a bit further back though. He's not dropped in 30 miles of John Dustin and uh, the uh, Nottingham car of uh, Kevin Spriggs as well, so a few more laps left to go for CG Tiro. We're making a battle of this, but I'm just telling you, three capacitors, he's got big problems on board now. Jamie Holby leads the way still then. Chris Allison lies second, then we've got Evan Smith into two but Chris Allison decides he wants to give the marshals a visit. Instead of paying attention to the rest of the race. Oh, bit of a knock as it goes through. He's trying to get that place back, he's desperate for that place. And he'll see the last half, he's only got one more lap left to make any sort of difference. Alan Smith goes wide though, and Chris Allison knocks back up on the inside, he manages to make the move stick. As he goes through, but Aaron Zook comes back through, right through on the inside. Jamie Holmby's coming around the final corner then. Your past six winner will go to Trent 47. Who takes the win? Then it's going to be Aaron Smith in the start, due to wait in second. Chris Allison will take third, then we're going to wait for fourth place. Alan Hughes, big problems on board, and it's going to relinquish the place. To your Nottingham driver is Kev Spruiter, who's going to finish off in fourth place. Then we've got North Yorkshire 35.